teeth are a common problem which can cause various issues such as chewing difficulties, increased risk of tooth injuries, difficulty cleaning the teeth, and of course, the insecurity and unwillingness to smile. But thankfully, there's various options nowadays to straighten them. So tell me, Dr. Bobby, how early can a child begin treatment? Well, I think all children should see an orthodontist before the age of nine years old so yep. that we can have some sort of assessment as to whether we think they might need braces in the future. Uh, sometimes problems aren't always obvious from the surface and you really need to uh, have that checked over first of all. But in terms of actually providing treatment for kids, look, it very much depends on the circumstances. The youngest kid that I've ever done orthodontic treatment on was four years old. Wow. But it's for a very specific problem, and that doesn't mean that all four-year-olds need treatment. Yeah. It's for a very specific issue. But average kid goes into, say, active orthodontics like normal braces around about 12, 13 years old. It's around about normal, give or take a year or so. Because I know with my son, he I did bring him to you when he was nine and he had the extra tooth and and having that removed, you know, it's made all of the difference. His teeth are so much straighter and mm -hmm. um, yeah, so it is that preventative yeah. side of things. Yeah, so I think you touched on the, the two different times when we would actually do, say, braces for children. So first of all, we may do braces in young children, mm. say, you know, nine, ten years old, but they're for very specific problems, in which case we're trying to intervene to prevent a bigger problem later on. Mm. You see what I mean? And that's very much what, what happened what, with, your, yeah. with your son. And uh, But the definitive treatment, in other words, to get that final perfect result, is usually when all the adult teeth are through, and that's usually around about 12, 13 years old for most kids. So what's the difference then between conventional and ceramic braces? It's really just a visual thing to be honest with you. Um, braces are, are literally just handles on the teeth. That's all they are. They're just handles on teeth. Doesn't matter what colour they are. Doesn't matter what they're made from. It's really just ceramic braces just look better than metal braces. When I was a kid, it was huge big metal bands around all of your teeth and they, they looked absolutely awful. But these days they're much more discreet. And, and, and they can uh, be clear. And they can be clear and they can be quite difficult to see from a distance. When you're close up you can see them but not so much not so much from a distance. So it's really just a, a social thing to make them look better. Love it. And um, what is Invisalign? So Invisalign is um, Invisalign's actually an American company and they make things called clear aligners and they're little, almost like little plastic mouth cards. Uh, and the idea with Invisalign or other clear aligners is that it's a completely new way of straightening teeth. It's got nothing to do with braces. It's uh, making plastic aligners and each one is subtly different. You change them every week or two and they just gradually just move your teeth into the correct position. So it's probably been the most interesting development in orthodontics in the last 10 years. Wow, and a lot of adults get that done, don't a they? A lot of adults get it done, but increasingly f much more in the way of children are having that done. You know, teenagers are becoming more and more image conscious. Vain. And it's like, vain. Let's just call it vain, as it is. Yes. They're becoming more vain. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> you know, a lot, of, a lot of kids are choosing that for various reasons, not, not just because of what it looks like, but because of specific advantages they hold over normal braces. So me as a vain woman, I've, I've got a bit of crookedness, so it sounds like I need to go get some invisible line. My bottom line. Nice yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, I'll be in shortly. So no matter how minor or major the situation, there's a treatment option out there that will help you or your child achieve the perfect smile. So for some expert advice, speak to Dr. Bobby and the team at Sunbird Orthodontics today.